Welcome to Colby Community College. Today, I'm going to show you how to navigate through your e-courses. First, if you go to the Colby website, which is colbycc.edu, and scroll down to the e-portal login, this is where you will log into your accounts. This is often called One Login or e-portal. Student accounts will be your first name, dot last name, at trojans.colbycc.edu. Faculty and staff members do not have the Trojans in their email if to help differentiate. Once you log in, it will take you to these four options. You'll have your help desk where you submit tickets if you need assistance from IT or maintenance. Your Google email and apps, this is where you'll check your email. Remember, it is very important that you check your email on a regular basis. Your Trojan Web is where you enrolled in classes. This is also where your unofficial transcript will be. Your midterm and final grades will be posted here as well, along with your student's schedule. Today, as I said, we're going to go through e-courses. This is also called e-college sometimes. When you select e-courses, it will take you to this home page. Here you will see there is the online orientation, online tutoring, and online career counseling. These are available to you if you wish to use them. In the upper left hand corner, you can select your academics tab and this will take you to your courses. Here you will see your classes listed. E-courses are fully online courses with no face-to-face -face time. E-companions are face-to-face -face classes or hybrid classes that meet face-to-face -face in a classroom at one point or another. Here today, I'm going to be using BT203 Veterinary Office and Computer Skills as an example. Here you will see the instructor is Melissa Vogt. You have the options to access your gradebook, email, Doc Sharing, Dropbox, Journal, and Tech Support. These are the tools we will be going over today. On the front page, you have your announcements, where the instructor can post updates, um, reminders, anything like that. Our course home is where we're at now. The syllabus for every class will be posted online. The syllabus offers office hours, the course rationale, the mission of Colby Community College, the competencies of what you will be going over. Different instructors will have different items listed. Units are displayed as big white bars. Once you select the unit, then items will appear as are available to you. This course only lets you see what you need to see at the moment. Once you complete one task, another one will open up to you. The gradebook lists all of the assignments and lets you know your grade to date. Reminder, if you do not turn something in, it will not show as a zero until the instructor puts a zero in the gradebook. So if you don't turn something in, it could say that you have a good grade. But once a zero is entered, it could turn your grade around. You also have the email application to where you can email instructors and students within your course. Document sharing is where you can upload or download documents Different instructors use this tool for different reasons. Oftentimes, if you are needed to share an item with the entire class, they will ask you to put in document sharing because then the entire class can access this document. The Dropbox will be where you hand in your assignments through eCollege. It's as simple as selecting Submit Assignment, and then you will select the basket or which assignment it is that you are submitting. And then you can add the attachment here or write a note in this box. Make sure you select Submit Assignment. 
and then it will be available to the instructor. Notice how the Dropbox is set up like an email. Once you submit something, it will go into your outbox and go into your instructor's inbox. Your instructor's inbox will then notify her or him that there is an assignment submitted. They can grade it and submit the assignment back to you. It will then go into your inbox and you can see comments and grades. The journal is another application to be used in eCollege sometimes. It is as simple as adding an entry. Once you add a journal entry, you have the option of making it private so no one else can see, or you share the entry with the instructor. Most of the time, you will share your entry with the instructor. The last tidbit to go over today is the tech support. This is tech support for eCollege. It is not your Colby Community College tech support. It is your eCollege support. If you need assistance with your eCollege, other than logging in or your account, this is where you will go. Thank you, and I hope you have a great semester at Colby Community College.